living, laughing, loving, but also tired of it. Specific series? My mental health just came out swinging this morning. But I feel at ease now. I feel like I can sit down and... I did it. Y'all should be proud of me. I defeated the waiting mode. Only in a little bit, but I did it. I have to go to the doctor. Nothing serious, just for blood work consultation, just a checkup. And it's at 1230. It was currently 10 a few minutes ago. Now it's closer to 11. And I'm stuck in waiting mode being like, oh, I don't really... I have videos and stuff that I want to start, things that I feel like I need to do and I want to get done today. But I'm like, I, it's probably better to wait after I go to town and go to the doctor and run some errands. But, but I conquered it. I conquered it. Because I went ahead and filmed the intro for a video. That way I don't have to worry about doing it later. I can just come home and get started on the actual video. And it didn't take as long as I thought it might. It actually went pretty well. That's a big plus because yesterday I tried to film an intro for a video and I just did not feel good about it whatsoever. It'll probably be fine once I get to editing it. But at the moment I was like, this just sucks. I recorded it like three times. Was not feeling it. It, like I said, it'll probably be fine, but it's also not a big deal if I have to re-record it later. It's not a big deal. So I'm proud of myself. Good job, Shay. Win. We love that for us. I think now, because now I'm in waiting mode worth even less time before I have to go, I think I'm gonna make a little snack. That way I'm not starving when I go. I'll probably read for a little bit or I'll just watch YouTube. I want to do something moderately productive. Maybe I'll bring my laptop in here and start cataloging some of my books. Maybe I'll do that for a little bit. We'll see. We'll see. I'll check in later. I just wanted to document that little win. Don't look at my five head. Okay? Don't look at my five head. I don't have... I don't have anything to distract you. <laughs> yeah. Update done. Let's go do something else. Like what, though? I think I'm gonna go get my laptop. God, I look like a freaking wreck, bro. Because you are a freaking wreck, bro. You are a freaking wreck, bro. I talk to myself alone like this when there's not a camera? Yeah. What's it to you? Alright, laptop. You're coming with me. Hostage non-negotiation. Oh no. Hold on. The charger is tangled up in it. We cannot have that. We cannot abide by that. Alright. Well. It's just you and me. Again. In my hallway. In my room. This is crap footage, Shay. Stop it. <laughs> Hello friends, I'm filming like five videos at once. I'm about to go outside and read some that is, like I said, I've been following my dopamine like that lately and I really enjoy it. I'm just really, really in a reading mood, so I'm gonna honor that and go outside while it's still very nice outside, because I've had a very busy day today, running everywhere, and yet still want to get a bunch of work done, so I think sitting down, making myself slow down and read is a good prescription, it's a good way to get out of my own head. I should be reading right now. I should be, but the brain goblins are on high alert, so I'm fighting them. The best way that I know how. Are you kidding me? Are you joking? Bro, I just, I quit playing instruments forever. I quit. I quit. Dopamine Shay checking in here because I am just about to go to my room and start finishing filming for a video that I'm doing. But I was sitting in here eating dinner because it's almost nine o'clock and browsing YouTube, and I got this random recommendation for a video by a band called Prompts. Well, it's by Grayscale Records, but it's Prompts, and I guess it's a brand new song because it's not even on Spotify. It was just uploaded 15 hours ago. It's called Sun Eater. What the f- I- I watched it because I was like, okay, thumbnail, we love her, I'll, I'll show you in a second, hold your horses. I'm obsessed, needless to say. I- I'm obsessed. As I was watching it, I got to like 157, 158, and my jaw went. I'm obsessed and I need it on Spotify now. I need everything that has ever existed about this. I need it. I need it. I need it. I'm sorry. I just like, I can't even go into like hyper, like I can't even pretend to like be hyper jumping all over because I'm just... 
my brain is trying to wrap 37 different ways around what I just heard and how much I feel about it. And I, this is a good reaction. It's next level when Shay is just like. Y'all just need to see this. Y'all need to see this. Y'all need to see this. Y'all need to see it. Y'all need to see it. <laughs> Excuse me? Excuse me? Excuse me? Excuse me? Wait up! God, I was worried that something would happen to you, and of course it has because you're a vampire. I'm sorry. I'm not. <laughs> Y'all, it is a dang good day for dopamine. Look at that sun. Look at it. I don't want you to look at it too long. I want you to hurt your eyes. I got a bunch of books. I got journals and stuff. I'm going to be occupied for the next several hours. I'm in one of my favorite tops. I got my chair back out, my sunshine chair. I got Stormy as my buddy to talk to. We're just going to have a really nice afternoon. I kind of want to go around the yard picking up sticks. There's a bunch of branches that have blown down from the storms. I kind of want to go around picking them up and get some exercise in today. But also, I'm enjoying the sun. I don't know. I've been reading The Ghost of Mrs. Muir. I'm definitely going to finish this today, 100%. I'm 50 pages into it just from sitting out here and reading it. It's only like 170 pages. Definitely gonna finish it. I might watch the movie tonight. I have a lot going on right now. And my brain's just kind of a whirlwind. So I'm trying to honor my dopamine while being on top of things and actually getting stuff done. The balance is never ending. But I think what helps me is, I don't know if it helps me or if it honestly hinders me. Doing a little bit at a time, sometimes it feels like it hinders me more than helps me because I think something that really helps me is just getting it all done rather than having to circle back to it. But then again, there are other times when it's like, all I need to do is just get a little bit of something done and I feel better about it and then I can circle back around to it. I think the issue is when I have so many things that I'm working on little by little, they all start to pile up and seem too daunting. And then I end up either like having a sort of mini breakdown about it, or I just like stick it out and I finish one and then I start to finish and compound the others. I don't know. I'm trying to find the balance between that because there's a lot of stuff that if I work on it slowly, it works out really well and I'm not stressed. But then there's other stuff that's like, if I work on it super slowly, it's almost like it never gets done and it changes. Like, and it's not just, and it's not just a category of things because I have several YouTube videos that I'm working on right now, but I'm working on them in increments and they're longer projects because I haven't gotten done editing them yet and they're taking forever. They just are because I'm working on them little by little. I didn't shut up. And then my Beartooth video, I didn't do it little by little. I just, <laughs> I just nonstop edited for three days. And there are other videos that I can work on little by little and they don't bother me that much. But these are like taking forever and I don't know why. I don't know what's going on. It's gotta be something else. Maybe it's some sort of mental time crunch I'm giving myself. I don't know. I've been getting a lot of reading done though, which is fun. Like a lot. Like I've been reading a book a day pretty much for the past few days. Some books that I've been meaning to read for a while. Like I finished For Whom the Bell Tolls by Hemingway, which is really good. I finished Southern Book Club's Guide to Slaying Vampires today, along with uh, Restaurant at the End of the Universe by Douglas Adams. Both were very good. Now I'm going to finish The Ghost of Mrs. Muir today, and I'm going to get even further in Christine as far as I can. And mostly I've just been sitting out here enjoying the sunshine, getting some fresh air. Because we're supposed to be having snow flurries on Friday. I don't know, dude. 
What I'm feeling right now, though, is like I want to go in and work on my videos, but I also, it's back to that I want to spend as much time as outside as possible. I'm stressing myself out being like I have all these projects that I need to finish, all these projects I need to do. I'm in the middle of doing them while I'm editing other projects that are in that stage of the project. And some are only in the stage of being filmed, and so I'm going back and forth. And what I keep telling myself is like I need to pick a focus. I need to sit down and like finish one one day like if there's a video that needs to just be edited and done i need to sit down and i just need to edit that video but then it gets on my nerves and i'm like well i should be finishing this other video i should be finishing filming this other video and i go back and forth between like okay i'm gonna film a little bit and then i'm gonna edit a little bit but i just need to sit down and either do one or the other i need to sit down and finish filming all of one video and then, or I need to sit down and finish editing one video so I can get it off my plate. I just can't keep doing this little increment business anymore. Not with longer projects, I can't do it. You'd think I know that by now, but... I'm a constant work in progress, what can I say? That's mainly the thing that's getting me down. It feels good to talk about that out loud because it's just been whirling in my head. I feel good kind of right now though. I don't feel bad, it's just I feel very tizzy, I feel very overwhelmed in general. Otherwise I feel good, because I've been reading a lot of good books, been crushing at reading books, been listening to a lot of good music, the weather's beautiful, I just gotta remind myself one step at a time, you know? Just as long as you come to me, your own. I'm back outside again, who's surprised? Not me, but we're finally getting consistent, sunny, beautiful weather. It's a little bit chilly. It's only chilly when the wind's blowing. I'm sitting right in the sun, so I'm pretty warm. I'm not gonna spend too long out here because I have some stuff I need to do, but you know what? This is following my dopamine. This is, I deserve some sunshine time, both for my health and for my sanity. And you know what? I don't have to deserve it. I can just do it. <laughs> gotta get out of the mindset of like deserving of stuff that makes you happy you know it's just a human right you ain't gotta be deserving just take it bro don't take that too literally i have my lunch i may come out here and read later i know i'm gonna bring my laptop out here and work because i do have some work that i need to get done but in the meantime this is how i am choosing to spend my time i'm really t trying to take away the terminology of treat myself because i want to save treating myself for actual treats doing stuff for my mental health and just my overall general happiness shouldn't always be considered a treat should just be considered part of the normal health plan part of my health care ironically i say as some sirens go by hope your health care is doing much better you hear a lot of sirens on this road so i'm gonna eat my lunch May come out here and read. Definitely gonna bring my laptop out here later and do some work. But for right now, I'm just gonna chill and enjoy some me time. Not even gonna film any b-roll. I just wanted to give that little ramble about the treating myself kind of thing. So the sun is starting to go away. It is at that point where it's just at the edge of the porch. So what am I doing? Standing as close to the rail as physically possible. And I am just leaning as close to the edge of the rail as I possibly can to get every little nucleus of sunshine that I possibly can. That is not the correct scientific term as a science major. I just finished some work though, so I feel like I deserve some, some more sunshine time. I might go out to the back porch, because we have a back porch. It's just not covered like this one is. And I might read. Question is, what do I want to read? I've been reading so much lately that I'm scared I'm burning myself out on it. But I want to keep reading. Maybe I'll just bring like a manga or something. Like more than one fight. And I can't imagine there's a lot of money in it, you know? Like football has been proven to cause like head injuries and pretty serious lifelong damage in many instances. I'm gonna say this is worse. I'm gonna go out on a limb and assume that this is worse.
Just doing some editing for my Halloween vlog right now. It's still over two hours, but I hope to get it down under two hours very soon. I think I can get it there if I cut out a lot of B-roll and stuff, but right now it's a little, still a little over two hours. And yes, I am currently listening to it while I'm talking to you. But we all make sacrifices. <laughs> my hearing, namely. But the sun is so pretty. I'm having a good time editing. I'm working on a bunch of projects I love. Just having a good time. Welcome to America. Oh, was ill timed. What the? It was Mark because I literally just started my video. So that's how I treat myself. So this is how I treat myself after a workout. Plus, of course, Mr. Markiplier. No one is surprised. It, I'm finally catching up on my three scary games videos. If you don't know, if you're new here, this is one of my favorite ongoing series on YouTube. I I just love it. So that's what I'm gonna do. So that's where I'm getting my dopamine from right now. I've had the zoomies like all day, so getting on the treadmill helped, or the walking pad helped a whole bunch of a lot. Because I have just been all over the place on my BS today. So that helped me get some zoomies out. Now I got some good food to replenish my nutrients. I got some good humor, got some good vibes going on. We're just have we're just gonna have a good rest of my Friday night. Well, I looked. <laughs> 